are departing Bangkok's Hualapong station on the overnight train to Chiang Mai. In second class, conditions are ample and some of the horror nightmare stories we all read about and hear on the internet, none of them are true. Okay, like it's a bit different over here, but we have we have the bunk, which the railway people will make up earlier. This is some luggage space here where you can fit a full-sized normal suitcase or backpack or whatever you like to take with you. This area, the two beds will be let out later by the railway staff and the upper bunk will also be converted so it's pretty good it will take about 14 hours to reach Chiang Mai but it should be fun this is the night train from Bangkok to Chiang Mai I have just made up my own bed now the guards normally do it but we spent the last while in the restaurant so uh, yeah it's like it's cozy it's about two and a half feet wide, maybe 80 centimeters. It's this little blind you pull around like you see here. I've opted for the lower, the lower bunk in second class, which is slightly more expensive, but it's like, it's still, it's still quite cheap. And there's this little ladder that goes up to the top bunks. And this is the top bunk here. And there's a, a place here where you can store your luggage. And yeah, second class is okay, it's fine. It's definitely well worth the experience. People you meet, places you see. This is the view from my bunk on the overnight train from Bangkok to Chiang Mai. As you can see, it's slightly cozy. As I say, maybe about two foot, two and a half feet wide, three feet. Second class, sleeper compartment pillow, bed sheets. We will shortly be approaching Chiang Mai station. Beautiful morning here in Northern Thailand. A pleasant overnight journey from Bangkok to Alapong station. Breakfast was served about an hour ago and all as well. Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn